Good morning, Shoreans. I'm Jimmy. And I'm Abby. Welcome back to the Shorean Report. Today is Monday, February 26th, 2024. Today is National Pistachio Day and National Fun Day. Yay, have some fun today. <laughs> this year we are beginning what we hope will be a new annual event, a boys volleyball game between Lakeview and Lake Shore. This game will take place on Wednesday, March 13th, 2024, during our Spirit Slash Charity Week. The game will begin at 6 p.m. and doors will open at 5 p.m. for all spectators, with admission being $5. No passes or exemptions will be made since this charity event is looking to raise money. The game will be played by the seniors from each school, playing five matches. Come support the seniors and help raise money for our charity week. Any students interested in joining the Clay Target Trap Shooting Team for the Spring 2024 season, please plan on attending an informational meeting held immediately following early release from school in Room 120 on Wednesday, February 28th. This meeting will explain the registration process, the basics of the sport, and how to get started. Returning members of the team may attend but are not required to attend. Please contact Mr. Hubbard with any questions as soon as possible. The Lakeshore Foundation for Educational Excellence and Ireland's Pub presents March Madness. Join the entire Shorian Nation on March 6, 2024, as we cheer our teachers on in their battle to win the championship of the year. During this fun-filled family event, you will have the opportunity to take part in games, raffles, 50-50 drawings, watch student performances, and root for your favorites on the court. Tickets are $3 for students, $5 for adults, or $12 for families. You can go. <laughs> no, 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 go down, go no, down, go down. Go down. <laughs> now we'll look at today's birthdays, see what's on the lunch menu, and get a check on that weather. It doesn't matter which. Put a big piece of bread on each side. You're in for a delicious ride. Peanut butter. Good morning. It's Ashley with the weather. I've been doing weather for forever now. We have changed jobs. It's okay. Um, it's 36, going to be like 49. So it's going to be an okay day outside. Not terrible. But if you stand in this sun ray in the comments, it's very warm. You can almost get a tan. Um, but. I couldn't go in my usual spot because there's construction people out there. As always, they always seem to be out there. When is that going to be done? Never? I think so. Anyway, have a good day. Welcome back to the Shorn Report. I'm Katie. And I'm CJ. Today the varsity boys basketball team will be at Cousineau High School doing their MHSAA District 22-1. Tomorrow the girls basketball team will be at uh, Lanphier High School with Varsity at 7 p.m. and JV at 5.30 p.m. There will be a meeting in the cafeteria on Wednesday, February 28th, immediately after school for any girls interested in playing Lakeshore softball this spring. It's not too late to sign up for track. You can see Coach Honold, room 129, Coach Phillips, room 138, or Coach Manila, room 136, to get the information. We will also post the QR, si QR code sign up in some classrooms as well. You must have a physical form and emergency card on file with Ms. Gill in the athletic office in order to participate on, by March 11th. Any boys interested in trying out for the Lakeshore baseball team this year should plan on attending a brief meeting on Monday, March 4th after school in the cafeteria. That's all we have today. That's all we have for you today, Shorians. Uh, good luck, story and athletes. Lakeshore High School has been known for having one of Michigan's more prestigious bowling programs. Due to being a part of the Macomb Area Conference MAC Red Division, the most challenging of the four divisions in their conference. But for LSH's senior Vance Harvey, this is an advantage, as he's been a part of Lakeshore's varsity division since freshman year and has big plans for the future. As the 2023-2024 season comes to a close, Vance Harvey reflects on his four-year LSHS bowling career and dives into his plans for the future. What it means to me to be a part of the Lakeshore High School bowling team is a sense of leadership and knowing that I have somewhere to go 
it keeps me busy and out of trouble. The advice that I would give to incoming bowlers is to just stick with it. It's a great way to make friends and it's the coaching staff is always going to be there for you no matter what you're going through whether it's like emotional stuff or if you just need help with bowling they're always going to be there for you. My favorite moment from bowling here is when we won the Macomb Area Conference varsity teams tournament. It was just a sense of unity between me and my teammates that was just unbreakable at that moment. And it was just a experience I would pay to go up and relive just one more time. If I got the opportunity to bowl collegiately, there's a couple schools that I'm looking at right now. One being Trine University. They have a really good bowling program. And then the next one I'm looking at is Spring Arbor University. They also have a good bowling program. And I'm excited to see where I can get with bowling in collegiate. As the 2023-2024 season winds down, Mewish fans the best of luck for the remainder of his senior season and his senior year. This is Emily Tulser. She thinks that she'll get away with her parents' financial aid. This is Emily Kinnicky. She's confused. This is Aubrey Searcy. She is educated and well-rounded. I'm a senior, and I'm so perfect, and I finished my fast four already, and I have loads of money. Well, I'm a senior, and I don't even know what fast four is. I'm a senior, and I only know about fast four through Miss Tansky competition. Aubrey, what is Miss Tansky's competition? Well, obviously, I'm the better Emily, because I know that there's a competition going on. Go. Oh. The LSHS choirs will be hosting Bingo in a Bake Sale at five, from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. today in the Lakeshore Cafeteria. Entry is $5 and proceeds will benefit the Lakeshore High School choirs. All ages are welcome to attend, so bring your whole family for a fun night of bingo and treats. The Lakeshore Art Department is preparing for the District Art Show on April 4th, 2024. We invite high school students to submit artwork for consideration. Students, if you've created artwork this year outside of an art class or a project for another class, you are welcome to submit your artwork to be considered for the district art show. Submit the Google form by March 15th, 2024. Stop by room 116 or email Ms. Camus at ikamus at shorian.org with any questions. The Lakeshore Foundation for Educational Excellence and Roy O'Brien Ford invite you to join the first Easter Egg Dive on March 21st, 2024. The Lakeshore High School pool will be filled with colorful eggs for participants to collect. Open Swim will be held after all collection. Pre-registration is required, $10 per child, only 30 spots per age group, 5 years and under will swim at 6 p.m., kindergarten and first grade at 6.30 p.m., second and third grade at 7 p.m., fourth and fifth grade at 7.30 p.m. Check in 15 minutes before the child's age group. Children five and under must be accompanied by in the water by an adult 18 years or older, one adult per child. All participants entering the water must be wearing proper swim attire. That is all we have for today. We will see you back for more announcements on Friday.